So one of the biggest disputes we have right now in the automotive scene is the dispute between air powered or battery powered. So today fighting back for the air powered tools is going to be this SP tools mini impact gun. We're going to go through this one today and show you guys just how awesome it is to start using air again. As if this video wasn't going to be cool enough already, we're going to be throwing in a giveaway. That's right, just as in the description, we're going to be giving away one of these tools. You guys need to make sure you pay attention all the way to the end of the video. I'll be going through all the rules for the giveaway contest. I, for one, have not been one of those guys to keep my viewpoints hidden, and I have definitely been a proponent for the switch over from pneumatic to electric tools in the most recent past. Uh, you guys have seen my videos on the Milwaukee and the Snap-on electric impacts, definitely a bunch over the last couple of months. But a lot of guys have been pointing out some of the drawbacks to the, some of those uh, newer electrical tools. Now, our battery life, uh, they has been going up and that's been one of the biggest points of switching over from pneumatic to electrical is the batteries and the lifespan of them and being able to use them for a better amount of time. Uh, that has helped out a lot and that's what killed the electric impacts uh, of the say five, 10 years ago. Now we're coming into a new day and age where the electric impacts are definitely catching up. But here's the big but fighting back. The pneumatics are coming out with a lot better technology. And one of the big technologies right these days is going to be the use of mini or stubby impacts. Today we're going to be showing you guys the use of the SP Tools SP1141B mini half inch impact wrench. Uh, so this impact is standard, held in your hand, looks like just a stubby impact. Now looking at this one, it's actually really, really small. At only 3.6 inches of length from back to the stub of the nose, this thing is super small. Uh, comparable one is going to be kind of like in the Matco range. Matco has come out with some newer technology in their uh, pneumatic sector, and they've come out with some stubby stuff. So is Astro Pneumatic and a couple of other vendors, uh, but none of them are really coming up to be as short as this one, at least not the ones that I've put in my hand. So this one has the impact to go along with it. This thing has all the balls that you guys would imagine and hope for out of a half inch impact stuffed into what would be normally a 3 8 stubby uh, size. The frame of this one is definitely a small frame and the weight on this one is what really makes this thing fight back for the pneumatic powered tools. Uh, this one's only coming in at 2.95 pounds, less than three pounds for an impact gun that's able to put out 715 foot pounds of torque. Uh, that's gonna be the bust away torque. The constant reverse torque on this one is gonna be right at 520 foot pounds of torque. Forward, we've got 310 max, and it is fully adjustable as well. Here on the back, we're gonna get into a little bit of a zoom in here of this one. It does have four selections on both forward and reverse. Three numbers, but four selections. One, two, three, four for max forward and one, two, three, four for max reverse as well. This one has all the goodies you really want to it and does not have to be uh, worrying about all the battery life and everything on top of that. Now, before we get into the hands-on portion of this one, let's talk about price point. Now, when we're comparing this to the electric tools, uh, there's a whole lot more factors that you kind of have to put into it. Both the cost of the tool, you've got the cost of the batteries, you've also got the cost of a charger. The batteries on the newer tools, yes, they do have a lot better life than they did, you know, say five or 10 years ago, but they still do have a life expectancy on them. Uh, nowadays, guys, they purchase these tools, but they don't use just those batteries for that tool. They buy multiple tools that use the same battery line. So those batteries are getting used across two, three, maybe even four tools in the shop throughout the day 
put back on the charger and they go through the cycles. These lithium ion batteries, they only have so many good cycles in them. So you may only get, usually in my circumstance on the kind of shop that I work that I use, I'm getting about a year, maybe a little bit over a year in the newer lithium ion batteries. I have gone through one or two of my Milwaukee ones already. So that's only been about 10 months worth of running. Each of these batteries, you know, you get between the Milwaukee ones or the Snap-on ones, the Snap-on ones are running like right at 90, 95 bucks. So just under a hundred dollars for a battery. So when you're talking about price point, you definitely have to factor that in going between electric or pneumatic. Now the cost difference of say the Matco version of this, which also is a little bit heavier, a little bit larger, and does not have quite the impact that this one does have. Matco one these days is running right at 350 bucks. Right now on SP Tools, this one's gonna cost you 100 bucks less than that, 250 bones. So enough of my gibbering and jabbering and blabbering, let's see this thing in use. So for the full use of this half inch mini impact, today I've got set up for you guys. Here in the shop, we have a 2016 Ram ProMaster. 3500, they're front wheel drive, they have really big front axles. This van has approximately 80,000 miles on it and I'm removing the transmission. So to remove the transmission, I've gotta pull the front axles. So the axle nuts on this particular model are 46 millimeter nuts. Now they are tagged in and notched with a little notch into the axle, so we have to cut that notch off so we don't damage the end of the axle. So you'll see in the video, after I remove the little notch, we're gonna use the stubby mini impact here to remove those 46 millimeter nuts. Now, what kind of a socket am I gonna be using? Actually, I'm gonna be using a snap-on 46 millimeter impact socket. The weight on this socket is three pounds, 13 and a half ounces. So the socket, the actual 46 millimeter socket weighs more than this 2.95 pound stubby impact. Let's see how this one fares up to the big 46 millimeter nuts on this ProMaster. So now, who thinks that that little half inch drive, stubby, that literally this 46 millimeter socket weighs more than the gun can take off this nut. about them apples. This thing is a beast for a tiny little impact gun. So did I tell you or did I tell you what? This little mini impact has got all the juice that you guys would think about needing in this size of a tool. If you guys were thinking about switching over to uh, the electric impact side of the market because the stubbies, they just got it going on. Well, this one might want to help you think twice about that decision. This thing has got all the guts. Uh, it's got a great warranty. It's got a one year fully covered warranty uh, replacement. No questions asked. You send it back to them. They'll either rebuild it or replace it. Not a problem. It's very nice, very ergonomic, very lightweight on top of that. It's gonna be one of the best ones in the market. And on top of that, it's gonna run a hundred bucks less than its leading competitor on the Matco side of the field right now. So at this point, you might be wondering, how can I get my hands on one of those half inch mini impact guns? So down in the description below, I will be putting a link to where you guys can get your hands on one of these. And like I said, for a hundred bucks less than the leading competitor, it's already a great buy. But because SB Tools has kind of teamed up with me, they decided they're gonna throw in something a little bit extra for my viewers. They're gonna throw in a five piece mini impact socket set from SP Tools. This one's gonna include a 13, 14, 17, 19, and 22 millimeter mini impact socket. So you guys are gonna get an extra buy on top of that. This one's gonna be thrown into the box for free for you guys. Yeah, I can hear you guys grumbling already. Get to the giveaway already, get to the giveaway. So there it is. Right now we're gonna be giving away one of these half inch drive mini impact guns from SB Tools. So three simple steps to be able to get entered into the giveaway for this impact. 
actually it's not going to be this one i've used this one you guys are going to get a brand new one of course but all you've got to do you have to be subscribed to the rust belt mechanic pretty simple on that one since you should be already if not make sure you hit that subscribe button number two down in the description or down in the comments below you need to enter say just enter me well, that's all i want you to put down there enter me that's all you need to do down in the comments and then third final thing that you guys need to be entered in for this contest is you need to cruise over to instagram and you need to follow sp tools because sp tools is putting out really great awesome tools new things to the market here all the time they're coming out with a whole slew of really cool things coming up in the near future that you guys are going to be the ones that want to get in on them as soon as they come out so Again, we're going to go over that one more time. Subscribe to the Rust Belt Mechanic. Enter me down in the comments below. Go over to Instagram and subscribe to SP Tools. So the next thing you guys really need to pay attention for is going to be August the 8th. That's two weeks from when this video airs. Two weeks down the road is when I'm going to be doing the selection and I'm going to put a video out there saying who won. So you guys not only have to pay attention to this video, but you all have to pay attention to that video as well to find out if you are going to be that lucky winner. At that time, you guys can send me a message either on email or on Instagram. Uh, we will verify that you have subscribed to me and subscribed to SB Tools and you're going to get your free $250 impact. All the necessary links to where you guys can find the half inch drive mini impact gun will be down in the description below so if that's something that fits your fancy and you really want one don't want to wait that two and a half weeks make sure you guys go and check them out they've also got a whole slew of uh, new great products and great tools coming out on the market all the time make sure you go and check out their website as well i'll put that one down in the links for the description also on top of that one We've got all kinds of new stuff coming out here. Also, the toolbox tour for the SP Tools box here at my house is gonna be coming very soon. I've got some more kind of organizational things that I really wanna get into this before I do a, to a full toolbox tour, but don't fret, it is gonna be coming out soon enough. We've got all kinds of more content coming out for the Duramax as well. So make sure you guys subscribe to the channel Turn on that bell notification so you get notified when I come out with cool, awesome content just like this one today. I appreciate you guys tuning in. Thanks, and as always, you guys stay awesome.